Hello, Hopkinton Middle School, and welcome to HMS Today. I'm your host, Callie Hopkins. We're happy to be back, and let's dive right into our show with a new Minute with the Teacher. This week, we're interviewing Mrs. Kirschenbaum. I always have really um, loved education. I always was um, an enthusiastic student myself, and Spanish was a subject I really enjoyed in school and that I studied in college, so it seemed like... Um, a really great next step in my career. I love making connections with my students. Um, it's definitely the most rewarding part of my job. Um, I love to have fun in class and convey my love for the Spanish language and culture to my um, students. And I hope that I'm successful in doing that most of the time during class. I learn from my students every single day, uh, lots of different things. I learn uh, patience, I learn um, understanding, I learn to be um, to see things through different eyes. Thanks, Mrs. Kirschenbaum, and you can see the full interview on our website because we couldn't fit it all in here. Next up, get ready for Fun Fact Friday. Good morning, and welcome to another edition of Fun Fact Friday. Did you know that on this date in history in 1909, inventor Leo Bakelin patents the first thermal setting plastic, sparking the birth of the plastic industry? He called it Bakelite. Also on this date in history, in 1941, the Imperial Japanese Navy, with, a, with 353 planes, attacked the U.S. fleet at Pearl Harbor Naval Base in Hawaii. The very next day, in a speech to the joint session of Congress, our president at the time, FDR, noted that the day before, Sunday, December 7, 1941, would be a date which will live in infamy. Also on this date in history, in 1988, the PLO, or the Palestine Liberation Organization delegation led by Yasser Arafat, proclaims the state of Palestine, thereby recognizing the existence of the state of Israel for the very first time. I just want to leave you with a party note, and I'm going to paraphrase our 41st president, President George Herbert Walker Bush. Please continue to be a brilliant diversity, spread like stars, Spread like a thousand points of light in a broad and peaceful sky. That's it for today, folks. Make it a great day, a better weekend, read a good book, and be kind to one another. A pleasure as always, Mr. Rockwood, and we'll see you again soon. Right now, it's time for question of the day. My favorite animal is unicorns. Dogs. Puppies. A wild margo. Kitties. My favorite animal is a monkey, and they should like this music. A zebra. Dolphins. Doggos. And now it's time for the birthday scroll. Happy birthday, everyone. We're almost out of time, but let's check out Have You Seen This? Looks like the extra time really paid off because we got eight correct answers. Here are our randomly selected three winners, as well as an additional winner for best compliment of the week. Thanks for playing and come back next time for our new Have You Seen This? And your chance to win a cool flashlight pen water bottle. That's all I got, so visit hms.today for all of our stuff, including expanded Mrs. Kirschenbaum interview and email us to tell us how we're doing. Now go out there and have a great day.